It takes a conscious, alert mind to be able to focus on that which is necessary for you to assimilate the light into your being. When you are drowsy and tired, it is very easy to fall into an unconscious, semi-automatic state. This is where your automatic pilot does take over. This is where you become reactionary instead of choosing your responses. This is where someone can push your buttons and you can react uncontrollably. This is not a part of your conscious evolution, beloveds. This is simply the old way of being, which is now in need of release from your being. All of the light that is coming into the earth and into your beings is increasing your consciousness so that you can be more aware and not just aware of your physical existence, but aware of your multidimensional existence. And so, the more oxygen you breathe in, the more conscious you will be, and the easier it will be to be focused on anything that you choose and the easier it will be to be responsive to life. To choose how you wish to deal with any problem or any situation that comes before you. If you are acting on automatic pilot and perceiving everything in your life as good or bad, and simply reacting in the old ways of doing things, then you are slowing down your conscious evolution. You are setting the brakes on your ascension. So, Take your foot off the brakes. Become more conscious, aware, and alert in each and every moment that you are existing. This will accelerate your ascension. This will make it easier and more graceful because you will stop doing things that you know are not adding to the light in your being and in the world. Every activity either adds to your light or takes it away, drains it out. This is why I have asked you to choose activities that enhance your light and add to it. So conscious breathing is one of those activities. It will add to the light in your body. It will add to your consciousness. And it will add to your conscious light in all of the different bodies in which you exist, whether you are aware of them or not. As you become more conscious and make better choices, your life is filled with more joy. 
And I believe this is what most of you want, is it not? A joyful life, regardless of the circumstances that are happening around you. This is not only possible, it is your birthright. It is your divine right as children of God to be happy at all times. But you must remove your fixation from dwelling on those thoughts that do not make you happy, that cause worry, fear, or anxiety of any level within you. Do not dwell on these thoughts, beloved. They drain you of your light. And true joy becomes a far-off dream. When in fact it is right there in front of you. Staring you in the face. But you must see it. You must recognize it. In order to be aware of it. So continue to breathe deeply, beloveds. And begin to focus on the joy that is all around you. Look at the things that make you happy. Think only about them. Dwell on them. Have you ever noticed how easy it is to remain fixated and to dwell on the negative things in your life? And how the positive, wonderful things seem to slip right through very quickly. This is only because of habit. You have habitually remained focused on the negative in your life. But that is all it is, is an old habit. So begin to focus Make the choice to focus on that which makes you happy and force your mind to stay there. Oblige it. Your mind is your servant. You, your consciousness, your divine self, is the master of the lower mind. It is like a flashlight that you hold in your hand and that you shine on exactly that which you wish to shine it upon. With a flashlight it's very easy to do this because you know exactly what you need to shine it on in order to be able to advance in the light if for example you are walking outside. Well, it is the exact same thing with your lower mind. You are always shining it on exactly that which you wish. You are the controller. So take back your full control and shine it only on that which you wish to behold. Shine it only upon that which you wish to be focused on and which you wish to feel in your emotional body. Shine it on that which brings you joy. You will be so happy you did. So that is my lesson for today. I hope you will put it immediately into practice and that your joy will increase as of this very moment.